It's been four years since the Bourne franchise hit the big screen, but the wait is finally over. Our Megan Tellis is taking us to the big premiere in Las Vegas. Matt Damon is back as Jason Bourne. Today's advancements in technology begging for more Bourne. Jason Bourne changed my entire career. And when we looked at what was different from 2007 when our last one came out to 2016, the world is entirely different. It's just been hacked. Could be worse than Snowden. They've really updated it to the world of spycraft in a post-Snowden world. Edward Snowden, real-life CIA employee, copying and leaking classified information from the government, lifting the curtain on global surveillance programs. Anything that we brought up in the movie, I would ask, well, is this possible now? Is it possible to tap in a phone? Is it possible to tap in a CCTV camera? And the answer was always yes. So it's really scary stuff. There's a demonstration in front of the Greek Parliament building. I think she'll use it as cover. The world has now changed and uh, this franchise is known for bringing up issues that are, feel so current to get the chance to play a character that is a symbol for this whole new wave of a new generation of technology I found extremely interesting. The 2016 baby and the last one born ultimatum your hair's chopped off all black what's coming next? Well I got to have my natural hair I just like that she became more of like a dissident she's more natural and not so much just the employee or the obedient good soldier. You can see Jason Bourne when it hits theaters Friday. In Las Vegas, I'm Megan Tellis.